Hey everybody, it's Star Wars Fan 71. Can't tell you how much I've been wanting to say that. My recovery period is finally over. The Let's Play I've been recording, well, I've had so many issues. Oh, whoops. I forgot to do something. Oh, on game. Huh? Oh, <laughs> must still be in here. Once upon a time, a spaceship named after something kind of weird. Sorry guys. Oh well, that'll have to do. Sorry, I'm just trying to adjust my camera a little bit. New camera I got for my birthday. Wrong button. Ooh, can't believe I didn't think of doing this. I think. There we go. It's a Pokeball. Cool. Oh my gosh, it's a meteor. Yeah, but my recordings of Sly Cooper 2, my sister ruined a couple videos. I tried compressing the files when my a new laptop came to me for Christmas, and I couldn't move those files, so for the second time, I'm going to, no, third time, I'm going to have to start over. My name is Captain Olima. When traveling through space, my ship was struck by a meteor. I must have blacked out, and I woke on the surface of a weird planet, with so many parts lost. The skeletal hull of my beloved dolphin is a painful sight. The engine is gone. I'm stranded to make matters worse. My astro astrospheric sensors indicate this planet's environment contains high levels of poisonous oxygen. My life support system can only function for only 30 days. If I can't repair the dolphin by then, no. 
I dare not think of that. I must find the missing ship parts. Earth to gain. Wish I remembered how to zoom in and out. Oh. before me. I had barely begun my search when it reared it up as if it were waiting for me. Then it dropped it then dropped a single seed. What is it? It's alive. Oh is it alive? Is it a machine? It resembles a vegetable on my home planet that we call an onion. I shall call this an onion too. You hit C to... The seed that the onion dropped took root in, in the soil and is now produced in adorable little sprout. This sprout emits a strange light and it sways back and forth without benefit of the wind. I cannot help but think it's calling to me. I am compelled. I must approach and press A. We will call him Steve and we will not like him. Extraordinary. When I plucked the sprout, it turned out to be a living creature, not a plant. Picking it has done no visible damage. It stands just there staring at me. Its shape is familiar. Is similar to the Pick Pick brand carrots I love so much. I believe I should call it a Pikmin. I'm here on a toxic. I'm here. I am stranded on a toxic planet, fighting to survive. Yet I'm intrigued. I must research these fascinating creatures. And grab it with A and throw in the direction I point. And I will call it to my side with B. Hmm. Perhaps it will react to C and pressing down on the D-pad while pointing as well. Viewpoints. Rotate camera. Left and right. Is the zoom in function on the D-pad. Up, you change perspective. Just let them carry those things. Wait a minute, what the? What the? For a second it looked like a yellow Pikmin. Ooh, it created two more. And swung more seeds. The small red pellet, the Pikmin who harvested after cutting down a flower, appears some type of food that propagate more Pikmin. The onion seems to be some sort of incubator. Needless to say, I must study this strange life form more. What the? I didn't hit C. Steve Clunk. It's not an incubator. It just makes clones of Steve. Oh, this is the Pikmin in your party. This is the ones on the field. This one's... These are the ones you have. Oh, I missed! What 
the heck? Where's the other one? Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot to mention, if you just mash the A button... There we go. Oh, I forgot about that one. What's that thing with all the pistons? Oh. I recovered zero out of 30 ship parts. I just need one more to increase the dolphin's capabilities. I didn't hit C. What the? Move it, you slackers. hit the C button? What is with this thing today? It's like a defective nunchuck. Down is actually the directional. The Pikmin are as curious as children. They form groups to perform tests, but tests that would be impossible for an individual. A glimmer of hope has begun to shine in my heart. If I can make use of their skills, perhaps I can fix my ship. I shall sum up all of I've warned about it. C is to dismiss. We'll go back to that thing in a minute. These slackers need to get more buddies. Oh yeah, if you have two Pikmin carrying these, they move a lot faster. Move faster! Okay. to that from the, from a move, from the movie Tombstone, you get 50 awesome points. Yeah, just mash the A button. Nobody cares. Oops. 
Okay. Not even the other members of the Steve Squad know this. Huh? Oh, there they are. You slackers. Oh my gosh. What's that thing? Amazing. There's no mistaking it. My ship and my ship's engine rests before my very eyes. By a stroke of pure luck, I have already stumbled upon the most important piece of my damaged craft. Fate has smiled upon me. But how will I get it back to the SS Dolphin? Just use down on the D-pad and have all these slackers carry it. I own every single Pikmin game. My god, the graphics in the third game are just awe-inspiring. Oh. Hold it, you slackers. This day is never ending in the game. Well, most days are about 15 minutes. And the only way to end this day is get the engine back to the dolphin. So I want these slackers to get that last helipode. And I think there's one more over here. Oh, nope. So, I'll have a grand total of 25. Oh. I'm gonna wait for these to sprout. Looks like a grand total of 25 can carry it. Wow, it's auto repairing itself just by having its engine intact. I would say I wish my car does that, but I don't have a car. Oh, glorious. We, with the help of these Pikmin, I have taken a huge step back towards home. My ship can once again lift off. The glimmer of hope is beginning to turn, burn more brightly. But what has become of the remaining parts? That search starts next Tuesday. Wow, you guys are slackers. I guess I should say goodbye to Steve. I never liked him anyways. OMG! The onion can fly! <sighs> One day since impact, I have somehow managed to launch the dolphin. But I was surprised to see the, on the onion lift off with me. Perhaps the Pikmin cannot survive overnight on the planet's surface. Or have they merely decided to join me for other reasons. Either way, it will seem that they will help me tomorrow. The dolphin is missing 29 parts. If I can't recover them all, I may never return home to my family on planet Hocketate. My analysis shows 
Life support system will function for 29 more days. How can I repair the dolphin in such a short time? A dense forest is visible on the surface below. As it holds the keys to my survival, I'll name it the Forest of Hope. I'll explore it next Tuesday. My first Let's Play, I was on day 30 and I had 13 parts. Well, my first Let's Play, my first run of this game. Oh, whoops, why did I go into this day? But see you guys next time.